Well, winds from Alberta will increase the risk for dangerous rip currents this weekend along our beaches. News for Jack's reporter Elizabeth Campbell spoke with the head of Ocean Rescue and beachgoers today about the riptide risk. She's joining us live at Jacksonville Beach with what they're all saying. Elizabeth. Well, the good news is there will be more lifeguards for this busy Memorial Day weekend, but that also means there's going to be more people on the beach. One thing to do is pay attention to the flags flying. Right now you can see it's yellow, meaning there's a moderate risk, but if that flag turns red, that means you need to stay out of the ocean unless you're a very experienced swimmer. As for the ocean, if you plan on having your children swim or even get their feet in, Ocean Rescue advises assign an adult to watch each child. That's one less that lifeguards have to worry about. A beautiful Friday, lots of sunshine, the beach already crowded as people, including the Rudolph family from Ohio, <laughs> are kicking off their Memorial Day weekend. Yeah, they're having a good time uh, trying to keep them, you know, up. Uh, Pretty much no more, well, for right now, until they get brave, pretty much no more above their ankles. Captain Rob Immeheiser with Jacksonville Beach Ocean Rescue urges all parents to always keep a close eye on their children. It makes lifeguards' jobs a bit easier. Go down to the water with them. Uh, don't be up at the high tide in your chair or on your phone. Uh, you can't watch them effectively like that. So stay down with the kids by the water, wherever they are. Brothers, 13-year-old Ashton and 9-year-old Ryan Glidden live in Jacksonville. They're familiar with the ocean and love swimming, but still don't take chances. I usually don't go past my waist because there's usually rip currents and high tides and they can pull you out pretty far. I like make sure um, like it's not too strong and like um, that I have like somebody older with me. Captain Emma Heiser reminds to listen to lifeguards. If you're uncertain about where to swim, ask. And if you do get caught in a rip current, don't fight it. Relax and float with it until you make it back to shore. Ocean Rescue also encourages you to avoid swimming by the pier because of the structure that can change currents and tides in the area. There's also going to be a lot of hooks and bait around the pier from people fishing, which in turn can lead to dangerous marine life going after that bait. Reporting live from Jacksonville Beach, Elizabeth Campbell, Channel 4, the local station.